What's going on guys, Sensei Bongsta here once again. Welcome to our yet another video. So today we're going to talk about Filmora 11. So let's watch this. Okay, thank you for watching guys. This B-roll or video was mainly edited using Filmora 11. So today we're going to talk about the added features of Filmora 11 and how can they compete or compared to Adobe Premiere, Final Cut and also DaVinci. We're also going to break down all the details, the transitions and the sound effects on this uh, basic timeline. So let's go ahead to our desktop. What's up guys, so welcome to our desktop right now. So we're here in the Wondershare Filmora. Uh, so first things first, we can all add this. We did the new project here. And in the widescreen, you can also Instagram, Portrait, Standard, Business, or Cinema. So after that, we uh, upload all the videos that we had, that we recorded, and then we import here to our media and after importing uh, we used the titles so titles you can choose any kind of titles here or openers they have lots of openers here that you can use that you can edit so that's the first track that we have here or you can go straight to your uh, videos they also have a stack media here, the audio titles, transitions, effects, elements, and split screen. So these are the screens that you can split in doing that. Then after that, after I uploaded all the tracks in here, without in a particular order, we also choose, uh, let's unlock this one, these Dama Beats from uh, Epidemic Sound. So they have all kinds of different kinds of audios, music, and also um, different kinds of effects for uh, sound effects and everything. After I choose uh, audio for that, I then started uh, choosing <coughs> uh, the clips or the videos that I wanted to edit here one by one. Then after adding those videos, you can also add the effects or the transitions. So these are the tr common transitions that um, you can use. The flip roll 4, 
there's a lot of transition here guys that it's really useful that we did use also or you can just use this uh, roll flip here in the middle and then you can just edit the properties transitions you want it to overlap prefix or postfix let's see what it does There you go guys it's flipping up then after uh, adding the transitions and basing it to the drama bits so as you can see with this one you can right click and then go to uh, <coughs> speed or animation or color or effect effect We also added these uh, audio effects here at the bottom to match it with the fire also from uh, epidemic sound so all of these <coughs> added just to add a little bit of flavor on the, on the clip there is no sounds here guys and we just added these <coughs> sizzling bubbles uh, from epidemic sound and also these chopping boards here that one it was added in epidemic sound also from epidemic sound <laughs> and also guys one of the new features that Filmora have is the color correction <laughs> as you can see all of these you have the preset available here that you can choose so vignette vignette 10 elegant shadow details but they're all uh, too dark for me so you can adjust manually adjust the white balance 3d lot that's all also for can the the presets that they have and the color you can add the exposure a little bit like that you can add the brightness <coughs> And the contrast just a little bit vibrance to pop the color more and here you have the histogram for your blue green and the red so you see the red are a little bit uh, high here the highlights the shadows the whites Oh, we just uh, so you can see the, the different guys this is the before and then that's the after after adjusting before and the after so it does make uh, a lot of improvement there the HSL for the red orange yellow um, green if you want the red to a little bit saturated you can do that if you will pop a little more reddish you can do that also so we're just gonna do it in a five or a three here because the hands are all changing also the luminance and then the vignette the amount if you want to add the white vignettes or the black one but let's put it to zero <coughs> okay so that's just the basic guys and you can save it as your a preset so you can use this as my kit, uh, kitchen preset and then use it after and then you can do it save it and then you can save it here if you go to custom and then here you can find here your my kitchen preset so that's really really cool guys okay so one thing and then that they add is this uh, speed ramping here speed ramping is uh, commonly used when you want to enhance your videos 
like they have a cost you can customize there's a montage hero moment bullet time jumper flash in and flash out so that's one you have a slow mo right here so this one is the fast the the how fast and how slow your your clip will be this one you can see here it's 10 times faster here and 0.5 slower here so if you're here if you see the movement it's a little bit slower here and then it goes fast and then the montage as you can see it's easy and it's getting slower and then you go and in the hero moment The bullet time as you can see if, um, as soon as you're changing the speed ramping your clip is also changing of uh, time duration okay so that's bullet time and then let's go to the jumper <clears throat> so the jumper is you can see it duration is, it's, it's all in slow first and then next time it's gonna jump Oh, let's hide this first and then it's gonna go. then after that it's gonna slow again then the flashing let's do the flashing and then, the go. And then the flash out let's do the flash out it's basically opposite of the flashing so from slow and then go fast so it's a flash out it's from slow motion to fast motion or regular motion of five times so that's the speed ramping guys that's the uh, 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 perfect uh, addition to Filmora 11 that we use on this clip so that's everything guys so that's it's only a basic uh, editing that we had for we just uh, finished editing for uh, one to two hours and after editing all of those uh, videos and added the uh, uh, video effects I mean audio effects on epidemic sound and choosing everything so there you go guys so I hope you like the video you can also uh, change this uh, audio guys there's a fade in if you do the fade in there's a little bit of uh, of a uh, volume adjustment here on your first and your audio and then here if you want your intro to be uh, minimal of volume you can adjust the fade in and then if you're going to fade out on the on the on the last part of your video you can adjust also the fade out so that the volume also will adjust you can do also the pitch and the equalizer I just do the default guys so you can also choose what kind of an equalizer that you wanted there's a different I just use the default so that's everything guys so yeah I hope you like it and then I just uh, thank you for following so back to you guys so that's everything guys thank you so much for watching please don't forget to like share and subscribe and don't forget to click that notification bell i really appreciate everything that you have done to this channel and thank you for supporting me and again this is sensei pamsta and sign